What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Grusby and today I'm going to play something a little different. I'm going to play a indie game called Froggy Pot. And uh, this is a sort of a slow burn uh, indie title about a frog girl that is uh, slowly cooking in a pot of boiling water. And it's your job to talk her out of it, I guess. Um, hmm, uh, I, I've heard some things about it and I've been curious to try this myself. So let's, uh, let's do this. Let's just jump right in. So let's, let's do, uh, let, let's see if we can rescue, uh, frog girl here. Okay. Froggy is sleeping soundly. The pot. It's warm and cozy now. But it will come to a boil eventually. Okay, wow. Froggy looks very, very happy floating in the pot. It will be dangerous, so please help convince Froggy to get out of the pot soon. I'm counting on you. Okay, you can count on me. Um, do I click Froggy? Uh, okay, so we can pick between, uh, hello, wakey, wakey, or this. Um, let's go with the, uh, the friendly. Let's go with, um, wakey, wakey. Oh! Cough, cough. Jeez, you scared me. Why are you in a pot? Why am I in a pot? Are you here? No, why are you here? I was having such a nice nap and you woke me up. Sorry for disturbing you. Apology accepted. That was fast. Haha, <laughs> relax, it's all good. Anyway, I'm just waiting for the water to heat up. It's nice and warm. You tired? Why don't you join me? Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> I, I know what's happening to the water. Hmm, the pot will come to a boil. The pot will come to a boil soon. Will you come out? Ah, don't worry. I'll get out eventually. I just want to relax for a bit. Once it gets too hot, I'll get out for sure. <laughs> yeah, that's what they all say. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Let's see, can we click the pot? How long have you been in here? I don't know. But it must have been quite a while now. But, oh man, I'm so tired. Some days are just like that. I don't want to do anything, you know? Hmm, yes, me too. I just want to, I want to relax and watch anime. In fact, I could be watching anime right now, but I've got to talk a frog girl out of a pot of boiling water. I'm sure you understand, right? Oh, I do. Anyway, what about you? So, uh, how's your day been? Uh, well, I'm doing live stream. Yeah, could be worse. Let me see. I'm feeling really happy. It's all right. Let's see what you do. Let's go with uh, spreading the happy. I'm feeling really happy. Something good happened? I'm happy for you, chump. Ch chump? Did you just call me a chump? Hmm, maybe one day I'll be as happy as you. Well, I can guarantee you, you'll be a lot happier if you get out of the water. Until then, stay smiling for me, bud. I'll catch up to you one day. Hmm, hmm. let's see. Poke? Hmm, the pot is getting pretty cozy. I feel it getting a little warmer. Want to join? 
<laughs> That's twice you've asked me to crawl off in this pot with you. Um, hmm. No thanks. You really should get out. Party pooper. Oh, look, I'm trying to save your life here. I could have went with the why are you wearing a jacket in the water, but I said, try, you know, trying to do good things here. You don't know how comfy it is to just sit in here. The world cold and hard, but in here warm and cozy. Hmm. If I get out, I'll have to return to being a responsible adult. Oh, okay. I see. I see how it is. Sigh. <laughs> I could go with the, you're an adult? Hmm. Uh, I can hear Twitter blowing up right now. Uh, let's see. What kind, what kind of responsibilities? Oh, just the usual. Work, clean the house, feed my ham ham. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? What? Ham ham? You have a, you have a ham ham. My hamster. Okay. Ham ham. Kind of don't want to think about all that right now. Jeez, who are you anyway? I'm going to be staying cozied up in here, so... Look, just leave me alone in peace, will ya? Hmm. Froggy is being quite the contrary froggy. Oak. Okay. Guess you aren't leaving. Why don't we talk about something else? So, anything you'd like to do? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I, I'm all about that anime life. Hmm, I like doing creative things, like playing games. My hobbies are beyond your puny mortal comprehension. I like playing games. Oh, me too. Maybe one day we can play a game together. That would be nice, but you'd have to get out of the pot of water first. You know, sometimes I get told that playing games is super unproductive. That I should be working on improving myself, my goals. But... Sometimes I want to grind in game and not real life, you know? But what about you? Any hobbies? Mm, I like guitar. In fact, I was playing a song just this morning. I wrote it myself. I'm very proud of it. Can I hear it? No! It's not good enough yet. <laughs> ah, yes. We are all our own worst critic when it comes to creativity. We love to create, we just scared to death of sharing it. It has breaks all over, it doesn't really follow any beats. Well, at least it has a good beginning, I think. <laughs> Not that you'd be able to hear it anyway. Oh right, another thing I love doing is origami. They say if you fold a thousand cranes, your wish will come true. Hmm. Oh, I don't have a wish if that's what you're asking. Do I need to have a wish? Hmm. No, not really. Hmm. Though, never thought about what I'd wish for if given the chance. Why don't you make a wish now? Uh, that's a neat idea. Hmm. I guess 
My wish would be to always be with the one I love. I suppose. But I don't know if that's possible right now. Why? Because you're floating on your back in a pot of slowly boiling water? Why not? Maybe when my time is up, too, we'll reunite in the sky. Oh, okay, I see. I see. Or wherever dead people go. <laughs> well, hmm. Sorry. Didn't mean to bring the mood down. Though, I still have so much to do. And yet... And yet you're... Slowly killing yourself in a pot of boiling water. I'm just lying here, floating away. Sigh. I'm sure they would want you to live well. I'm sure she would. The person most important to me goes by the name Sap. Hmm, Sap. I miss Sap. Please, get out of the pot. I'm sorry, I can't. I don't know why. When I'm in here, my knees feel weak and arm spaghetti. <laughs> what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute now. <laughs> um, is there a vomit on your sweater? Is it perhaps mom's, mom's spaghetti? Wait a minute. I'm think I'm think I'm getting some verses confused here. I just can't move. I just can't. Uh, do a quick save here. I have a feeling we're fixing to start hitting some different routes here if I'm not careful. Oak. I haven't seen the sky in a while. Speaking of the sky, I've always wanted to go to space. <laughs> wow. What a change in topic. Me too. I'd love to go to space. I wanted to be an astronaut. Hmm. The first frog in space. Hmm. I need to talk to Elon Musk about that. Maybe instead of cat girls, we can get frog girls. But that seems too hard. So instead, I fold paper planes and dream of the skies. Hmm, Poke. Oh, you're still here. It hasn't been that long. This must be incredibly boring for you. Hmm, I could be watching anime right now. I've got a whole bunch that I need to, I need to catch up on. And I think we just started a new season. I'm sorry. I didn't think you'd stay this long. Maybe it's time for you to leave. Man, it's getting hot in here, huh? Oh. We gotta hurry this up. You're starting to cook, Froggy. Froggy, why won't you leave this pot? I... I know I've got to get out soon. But even if I go back, what will I do? Back to work, the hustle, the grind, all that. And to what end? And at the end of the day, no one is there to share my days with. No one anymore. I'm tired. If passion is a candle, mine burned out a long time ago. <sighs> Still, no good will come of staying here.
the world that awaits me outside this pot, do I really belong there? You know, everyone I know is so different from me. They have their passions and dreams, but I don't really have any. Yet, being with Sap made me happy. Sap made me a better person. I know it shouldn't be this way, but Sap was my passion, in a sense. Sap saw value in the things I did and encouraged me. And then there was one person in this world with me. But now that Sap's gone, I don't know what to do anymore. Sap passed away from illness about a year ago. Since then, I've been in stagnation. These days, I just wade through life without much meaning. But lying in here brings me some comfort at least. Tell me, is that wrong? Hmm. Um... Do you think I'm letting my family down? Whoa, that's a deep one. It's something that's been on my mind lately. Even though Sab's gone. My family are still relying on me back home. But here I am. Just staying here, not doing anything. It's as if time stops when I'm in this pot. No more worries, no more troubles. They're expecting great things of me. If they found out about my situation right now, they'd surely be disappointed in me. Hmm, let's see. You have to think about your own happiness too, but I don't know what happens. I don't know what happiness looks like to me. Sap used to be here, and I was happy then. But not anymore. You think I can still be happy on my own? Ugh. Hmm. If you don't leave this pot, You'll never know. True, but... If I get out of the pot, will there be anything worth going back to? When I meet my friends, they'll ask how my job is going, if I'm doing something exciting. But I don't have anything to talk about other than my hamster, I suppose. You mean Ham Ham? He's kind of old, but he's still killing it at the wheel. Good old Ham Ham. When I meet my family, they'll ask me about the things I've achieved over the year. How am I supposed to tell them I've done nothing? My life has remained the same. Time is slipping away. At my age, everyone else has already moved on, but I'm stuck here. Okay, uh, let's do a quick save. This is where we get to, I guess, put ourselves out there. I'll still be here for you. Please, don't say that. We met a few minutes ago. How much could you possibly know about me? Ah, uh, there it is. There's the how much could you possibly know about me question. Ultimately, what happens to Froggy is inconsequential to you. 
because you'll continue to live and exist and life will go on for you regardless. You'll eventually forget about Froggy in due time. I'm just a passing Froggy in a pot. Okay, that that's kind of cute sounding. I don't know why that, that sounds like it needs to be on a t-shirt. Just a passing Froggy in a pot. It, it's terrible because I know I know what's happening. I know the pot is getting hotter by the moment. You just want to be happy you saved Froggy. Uh, well, maybe. I would like to save your life and then go back to watching anime. Let's see, do I want to do the, I do care about you. I really want you to be happy. Please just get out of the pot. Let's, uh. Do a save here. Uh, let's do the, please just get out of the pot. You. If you really wanted to save me, you would have pulled me out of the pot. Oh, snap! That's, uh, that's some heavy logic. If you really wanted to save me, you would have tried to turn the heat off. If you really wanted, you would come here right now. Stupid. But you just sit there talking to me, asking me to get out. But you don't do anything. You're not my friend. You're just a stranger. You're you're not sap. No, I'm not sap. I'm not ham ham. I'm gruz gruz. Froggy has nothing to go back to. Passion, love, happiness, wishes. Such things are fleeting for Froggy, yet despite my flawed self, I found someone who accepted me and loved me, but even they are not here anymore. So tell me, how should I... How should I continue to exist huh. <laughs> huh I get uh hmm do, is it uh is it all in the inflection is it is it I don't know is it I don't know or is it I don't know let's uh let's do the uh let's do the question I don't know Of course you don't. Because you are me. Oh! Oh, snap! I did not see that coming! The person I've been talking to is myself, isn't it? Convincing myself to get out of the pot with words Sap used to tell me holding on to the tiny pieces of heart she gave me. Coming up with reasons to continue trying. Every day I tell myself to get out of this pot. It should be easy. So why is it so hard? Hmm. Interesting turn of events here. Uh, save here. Uh, poke. I'm truly hopeless, aren't I? It's not like I don't try. I don't want to stay like this. But every time I... I think... What if I get out of the pot and I do my best and things don't change? What if it doesn't get better after all? I would end up feeling worse than if I never got out. Is that kind of world worth going back to? 
Well, I end up talking to myself, consoling myself like this to get out of the pot. Hmm. Ah, Froggy seems to think you aren't real. Oh, I'm very real. That you're just imaginary. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm, let's see. All right, I think this is definitely going to need another save. Let's save there. Hello, Earth to Froggy. Uh, no, let's do this one. Excuse you, I'm a separate person, you know. Huh? Huh. Hmm, interesting, interesting points. I'm me, you're you, you aren't talking to yourself. Uh, you have a hamster, but I sure don't. Let's try the, uh, the jovial approach. Shake my head. I would never wear a hoodie in a pot filled with water like you would. You! Hey! I don't understand. You are not alone here. I'm here with you. You... You say you're real? I'm not just talking to myself the whole time? But if so, how come I can't see you? Oh, ho, ho, we're fixing to get meta? You are just a voice. So I must be imagining things. I must be so far gone I've started hallucinating or something. If you really are real, come here right now. Huh. I wish I can come, but I physically cannot enter your world. You're saying you're not from this world? <laughs> That's right. I have been isekai Just my voice. I don't understand. I want to help you, but I cannot come to your world. I... So, talking is the only thing I can do. I see. But you're just someone I met a few minutes ago. Why do you care what happens to Froggy? Do I need a reason to care about someone else? You know... That's what Sap told me when we first met. I had nothing to offer her, but she cared. Maybe I had it wrong the whole time. If you say you are real, prove it. Prove to me that you're here. How? I don't know. If you were me, you wouldn't know how either. Please, tell me. Hmm... Tell me I'm not alone. It seems like Froggy isn't fully convinced. Froggy can't see me, but there's one thing I can do. I can tell Froggy my name. My name is Grusby. Grusby? So you really are from another world, Grusby. <laughs> yeah, no one else has this name. You're real. Sniffle. Huh. Oh no! 
Oh no, what if I said, oh no, what if I said, haha, just kidding, I'm actually just in your head. Oh, that's so mean. Oh, I may have to, uh, I may have to try that. We have to try that. Um, let's, let's do this the right way. Let's do this the right way. And then we'll, uh, we'll go back to, we'll go back to this and see what happens. I don't think I have it in me to be so cruel. Uh... Right in the flesh, I am. <laughs> Man. Jeez. This sure is a long day. I don't know if I have the strength to face the outside world right now. I'm still afraid of messing up. Huh. It's okay to mess up. No one is perfect. But despite everything, you're still here, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm still here. Um. Do you think it'll get better after I go back? I don't know, really. Yeah, of course. You aren't clairvoyant. No, nope. I'm just a guy that likes to watch anime. Ha <laughs> ha, I suppose there really is no way of knowing. That be life, uh-huh. That be life. Oh, let's see. Have we succeeded? Let's find out. Oh, can Froggy ask you something? What is it? Are we friends now? <laughs> hmm. Gasp! You mean we weren't friends until now? I just wanted to confirm. Thanks, Grusby. And sorry for calling you a stranger just now. Sigh. I've been here long enough. Well, it's about time I get out of the pot. Though it's cheesy having someone to talk to that isn't myself. I feel a little better. Back into a world of uncertainty I go. I will most definitely feel hopeless again once I leave this pot. But life has to go on, even if there isn't meaning, I suppose. At the very least, I still have to take care of Ham Ham. That's right. You need to take care of your hamster. My hamster. Thank you for talking to me. It's been a while since I talked to someone other than myself. Froggy has been living alone for so long now, away from my family. And Sap. I don't know if life will get any easier and less confusing but I suppose I can't stay here forever. You know, Sap once told me, a pebble that lies on the shore of a beach doesn't need a reason to be there. It just is. It just exists. But it doesn't make it any less of a pebble. So I guess for now, it's okay for me to simply exist too. Until the day I can be happy again. Until then, I'll get out of the pot for now. Thank you, Grusby. Though you are so far away, Froggy will always be cheering you. 
pen. Ah, that's nice. We succeeded. Cantus, hello. This is Can Cantus Mori, the creator of Froggy Pot. Uh, or rather, I'm Cantus, a robot bunny acting as a vessel for my creator. But, well, you can treat me and Cantus Mori as the same person, really. Though, to be honest, I wrote in this section, even though the game is over, but I'm not quite sure what to say. You look kind of funky. <laughs> you noticed. My body looks kind of, uh... Wonky. Uh, I knew I should have asked for some colors. Did it again. We did run out of budget for the spray paint. Uh, without color, my body is in such a sorry state. Snipple. My lines look like they're about to fall apart like my ego right now. Sigh. Uh, are you okay? Yes, yeah, sorry about that. I do wish I could have met you in a more presentable form but for now this will do it's all right one day i'll get an upgrade for sure next time be prepared for my new marvelous form with color in a few years maybe one day i'll finally be able to save up enough to get a nicer form but wait that's not the point of me coming here i'm here because i just wanted to tell you Thank you for playing, is all. And, uh... Awkward silence. You have my best wishes. Farewell. Okay, wow. That's a very bittersweet little game there. Uh... I am curious to know what would happen if I... If I did that other thing where I... I said, uh... I said that I was all a figment of her imagination. Um, do we really want to go down this dark path? I'm, I'm not really a completionist. I normally don't do all the endings. I find the best ending and then walk away and pray I never have to make any more of the same mistakes again. But I can't help myself. Let's just say... Uh... Ha ha, just kidding, I'm actually just in your head. Hey, stop messing with me already, jeez. I would never have thought of such a lame name, even in my imagination. Oh, wait, now, you're, you're saying that my name is lame? How dare you? So you must be someone other than me. Ha ha. Man. Jeez. This sure is a long day. I don't know if I have the strength to face the outside world. I'm still afraid of messing up. Okay, so it, it really doesn't change anything. I think once I give her my name, it really is a, a, a an affirmation that she's not crazy or that she's not actually talking to herself, that the voice she's hearing is actually someone other than herself so um there's that uh interesting very interesting uh we're gonna go ahead and uh go back to the main menu here uh this is a very very interesting little game and i i really enjoyed it uh i would be really fascinated to see uh, something else by Cantus Mori. It, it, it really uh, had a had a tone there that that resonated. I really liked it. Uh, it was really good. Very short. Very sweet. There it is, Froggy Pot. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, if you did, and you want to see more games like this, then be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you're new, subscribe so that you can see more. And uh, I'd love to get your comments, so make sure that you put those in the comment section down below, guys. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Grusby, and I'll see you guys in the next video.